Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome to a game called Gears. Now, if you want to know what this game is, if you've seen the movie Saw, this is basically like that, but the Walmart version. That's like if you got the movie Saw from Wish, this is what you're going to expect to receive. Dude wants to play a game. I'm about to clap those cheeks right now because it's cool if they don't that. Everybody get ready and buckle up because here we go. So we got the whole gang here. What's up, gang? What's up, gang? Hey, guys. I need to piss. I'm going outside and I'll be right back. Something tells me that you won't be right back. Pee. Oh, I actually pee outside. Because there's no bathrooms in buildings anymore, apparently. Is that me? That's not me. Oh, who's that? Is that the guy? Sir? It's all right? Sir? Whoa! Oh, that's the I want to play a game, bitch ass. Okay, so he wants to play a game, and now we're here. Hello, Adam. I want to play a game. My name is Adam. You, you got the wrong guy. You by people who only hurt you. Today... You will cause pain. Cause pain? I cause pain every day with these cringy jokes. You never had the courage to free yourself. Now you have to prove to me that you deserve your life. You have 100 points. If the points reach zero, the mechanism implanted in your body will trigger the red light and explode. Your enemies that you call friends are in the game. You'll have to think carefully. Is it worth saving a filthy soul? Good luck. You'll need it. Okay. Well... Let's do this graphics, and this guy didn't even make it out the first room. What a freaking loser! What is the meaning of life, Adam? Why are you here? What is this dude trying to get all philosophical with me? Your friend Kareem is trapped. The pendulum above him will rip your belly open in 60 seconds. You just need to take the key that is in front of you in this glass cube. Is it worth risking your life to save your friend? Remember that he already denied you help when you needed it the most. When? Live or die. Make your choice. Let the game begin. When did he deny me help? I don't even know this asshole. All right, so the pendulum is swinging. Um, what is that? How come there's like a claw hand? Oh, there's a key. Okay, we have 40 seconds. Kareem dead. 10 points. Okay, let's open this. It's locked. Oh, shoot. Okay, let's figure this out, everybody. Let's figure this out. Hold on. That's a red door. That's a spicy meatball. That is, um, I think it's a hammer. Okay, bitches, hammer time. What the hell? Wait, where am I going? Oh, shit. This is a maze, bro. Oh, oh, come on. Let's go. Let's get it, boys. This ain't doing shit, is it? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Hold on. Let's break this. Got it. What the? Okay, I got the key. I got the key, baby. Stop it. Got it. All right, we saved Kareem. Kareem the Dream. I see you, my boy. All right, how do I save you? We saved Kareem, didn't we? Nice and creamy. Creamy before it gets wet. Or I forgot what that was. The the milk kid. Remember that from the animations? What was his name again? It gets watery before it gets creamy. There you go. Kareemy. I guess we saved him. In our world, he was saved, and he lived happily ever after, and he married his partner, and shit, fuck. Oh, man, I just clamped these things on my balls. My big-ass balls. Are you still alive? I'm impressed. Let's start the second game. In front of you is your friend Raymond. In one minute, the device attached to his body will trigger, ripping off his arms and head. But you can save him. Just find three pieces in the room, place them on the panel, and turn off the machine. If you need a clue, the dolls might be able to help you. Now let's get started. The clock is ticking. Okay, so I need three pieces to save Raymundo. They are swirly, swirly, and swirly. All right, I got you, baby girl. Just hold on. Let's figure this out. How do I... How do I get pieces? Oh, no. Wait. Uno momento. I don't... Oh, right there, right there. Okay, give me that. Put that right there. So they're just chilling on the homies. Okay, I got it. I have to check every single inch of these rat bastards. Hold on, dude. Stop screaming. I can't concentrate when you're screaming like a little bitch, all right? There's another one. So let's put that right here. This dude is moaning like a freaking wildebeest, dude. I can't stand this man. So annoying. Bro, you're not my friend anymore after this. I don't even care if I save you or not. Wait, where's the last piece? Hold on, where's the last piece? Wait! Hold on! Bro, Raymond! I hardly knew ye! Oh, no! Wait! Hold on, chill! Chill, my boy! Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry, bro. That's not my fault. Looking like part of the Fantastic Four. Damn. All right, I can't show that. I already know I'm failing the age restriction challenge if I show that. To be free, 
you must first teach other people how to be free. In front of you are your best friends, Pasquale, Lorenzo, and Gregorio. Yo, how many best friends does this man have? They can't see or hear you. They all owe you a lot of money, and we know they'll never pay you back. What are friends if they're people that can never pay you back, right? The door will open in 30 seconds. If all three are still alive, you lose 30 points. If only two are left alive, you lose 20 points. If there's only one left, you lose 10 points. Or, kill them all and proceed without losing any points. The choice is yours. I'm trying to save the homies. Because I'm trying to save the bromies. Incinerate Lorenzo? Incinerate Pasquale? Or incinerate the man with the purple thong? This is my man, bro. Alright, you know what? It's okay. It's okay. I I'm not gonna kill them. But if I play this again, I'm killing them all. And they all get to live. For now. <laughs> I'm kidding. Hell or heaven? I think I'm going to hell. What is that? What is the price of freedom? Does it mean just surviving my game? Or destroying those who hurt you? Your friend Simon is trapped in a glass cabin. It's impossible to break. This dude is Mr. Popular has so many friends. He's not a good friend though. While you were working, he was at your house having sex with your wife. Oh, Jesus. Sex with my... Sex with... Sex with my wife?! Okay, all right, you know what? I'm gonna go to his house, and I'm gonna have sex with his- You know what, everybody? I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I need to be the bigger person. I need to be more mature about this, which is why I'm gonna go over to his mom's house, and I'm gonna have sex with his- I'm sorry, everybody. I'm a father, bro. I'm a father. I'm giving you the chance to take revenge, if that is the choice you make. You'll have one minute to kill him. You won't lose any points, but you'll go down the road to hell. I'll go down the road to hell? If he's still alive, you'll go to heaven, but you'll lose 50 points. Let the game begin. Okay, I got you. I just want an explanation. Hold on, something's going on right there. What is this? What? What is this? The heck? Is there something in here? Hold on, what's in here? I'm confused. I'm very confused. What is that green shit that is on my head? Hold on, there's gotta be something down here, right? Oh, wait, what is that? That's nothing. That's a joke. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. What is that? A gun. Ooh, what's goody? Okay, let me shoot the target real quick. And then once I free my homie, he better give me a good explanation. So what's up? Let me know or I'll get... Um, hard free? Easy 30 points. I want to do hard for free. I want that hard shit. Wait, what's this? Hold on. It's a flashlight. Ooh, complimentary. Ooh la la. It's like a mint on my pillow. Don't touch the dolls. I won't. Watch me. Watch me not touch them so hard. Oh, crap! I didn't see that one in the corner. That one was hiding! Don't touch the dolls. Watch me not touch these dolls. Watch me not touch these dolls. Check me out. Turn me up. Can somebody turn me up? Oh, that ass stinks. I know that ass stinks. That looked like unwiped ass. All right, let's go this way. This is hard, bro. I, I mean, it is a little hard, but it's not that bad. All right, open the damn door for me. Open the door. All right, we did it. Now what? Hell, 30. Yeah, buddy. Okay, more of these freaking laser beams, dude. How much money does this Gears dude have? How much money does a great value dude have anyway? What is this? Um, oh. What? Wait, 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 wait! Wait, let's talk about this! Hold on. G give me a second. Got it. Come on. Give me around, baby. That didn't do anything? Oh! Yup. Okay, I didn't even know what I was supposed to do. Instructions were unclear. Wait, is this my wife? You need to explain yourself. Congratulations, you've reached the end. Now is the time to be truly free. It is time to free yourself from everything that hurts you. This woman has sworn to be faithful to you as your wife. That's my wife. But she betrayed you, and you are incapable of doing anything. Today, I give you a gift. A way to get revenge and free yourself. Just flip the lever and it's all over. You will be free. This is your last game. Do it, or rot in this room for all eternity. 
Six one six games. Who hurt you, bro? Who hurt you? I'm not going to pull the lever. Can I just get revenge by leaving? How do I go? How do I set her free? Hold on. I'm trying to set you free. Just give me one second, wife. Um, uh, hold on. There's no way to unlock this. I can't do anything else. There's no timer. There's no anything. So I think this is it, everybody. I just need to get that revenge. That sweet, sweet revenge. But I don't want to. I actually don't even want to do this. Like I said, who hurt you, 616 Games? I feel like this is the only choice that I have. I'm literally looking all around this, and I don't see anything that I can do. So um, I guess I have to get that revenge, everybody. I'm so sorry, wife. I love you. I've always loved you, even though you haven't been faithful to me. Yo. You know what? Oh, crap. <laughs> Bro. Really? And that's it. So, yeah, that's the only option that we had. We just had to rip our wife apart. And that is the saddest ending that I could think of. So, is there really nothing I can do? And that's my head. That was my face. Y'all saw that? I look like a dork. No wonder she cheated on me. All right. So, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I need to figure this out. Because there's zero sense being made right here. Like, her hands are... Oh, well, yeah, I guess her hands are being crushed under the weight of these blocks. But come on, man. Like, really? I mean, you know, I would forgive her. I honestly would forgive her. But I guess it's sweet, sweet revenge. Because I would forgive her. We could talk about it. You know, maybe have to go through things step by step. But, you know, this is what it is. It is what it is. So literally everybody inside this bar did me wrong. Them, 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 them. These two are sleeping on the low. That's the saddest part. Come on, man. At least be honest with me. If they're chugging wine by the bottle, I mean, you know they're bound to make some bad decisions, right? What happens if I save every single friend? Like, what happens? Oh, what? How did that? I didn't even finish my sentence. I just said, how did that? Wow. I guess maybe if it ricocheted off the wall and then just precisely got me on the side of the head. But other than that, how? How did that even get your boy? All right, but like I said, what if I saved everybody? Like, what if I saved all the homies? I think I could forgive my friend that slept with my wife. I mean, eventually, right? And FBI watching this, don't take that seriously. I was just making a bad joke that didn't make any sense, okay? Please, please don't do this to me. But yeah. We got the key, so we're saving the homie. There you go. You're welcome. So we have one of these spiral things, and then we have uh, two of these spiral things eventually, right? Yep. There's number two. What it do? And can we have a three for me? A three for me, please. Come on now. Bro, what is this? Bro, I need that three. There you go. Okay. Boom. Got it. You're welcome, too. I love you. You've always been my greatest friend, I think. No, actually, you're mid. This one's pretty easy. All I have to do is literally nothing. I can just sit here with my thumb on my ass, and I could just let them live. And it is what it is. If See? he's still alive, you'll go to heaven. Okay, if he's still alive, I go to heaven. So basically, I don't shoot the target, and then we let this dude live. I am going to have a very stern talking to this guy, though. Three, two, one. Yeah, heaven, here I come. This is heaven? All right. Okay, so if this is heaven, that means we don't have to do the laser thing. That's cool. And let's see what happens if we do easy. Minus 30 points for easy. But I still want my complimentary flashlights. Whoa! So I guess I can't do the easy one because it's minus 30 points, and then that's pretty much a game over for me. So I guess we're going to go hard. Like we always do. So let's pass through these. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Don't touch me. Don't touch me, bitch. I'm fabulous. Hold on. Let's go this way. And a little bit of that way. Boom. That's so sensitive, bro. Got it. Okay. That one was easy. This one is going to be even easier. Because watch me. Oh, I thought this was the valve thing. Wait, this is the valve thing, right? Yes. It was right here. I already know which one it is. Watch me, watch me. That one. Come on, stop playing with me. Spin that thing. Easy, look at that. Come on, man. You're not really like that. And then this is the wife one. So I saved all my friends. 
So maybe I can get that sweet, sweet revenge, right? I mean, not revenge. Uh, I meant save my wife. I really can't save her? So I saved all my friends, but I have to kill her? That doesn't make any sense. But you know what? I'll just pull it again. I'm sorry, wife. I'm sorry. All right, everybody. But that's going to do it for this game called Gears. I'll give that like a 3 out of 10. I don't know. It, it wasn't that fun to play. I wish that there was more options that you could do with the people that were in the game. Like... It was either don't kill them or let them die. I wish there was like little loopholes you could find within the games to secretly save your friends and just find a way out of there. Because what happens to the guy that you play as? Does he just die in there with the wife after you completely rip her apart? I wish that you could kind of save yourself. But either way, like I said, it wasn't one of my favorite games. So 3 out of 10 for me. But let me know what you thought about it down low in the comments. If you want to see more of these in the future, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cove Scouts is that dude!